Good morning, everybody. Um, man, last night was a much better night. I slept all night, which is really good. Uh, Sarah only got up once, and so I got up to help her. <clears throat> and um, but yeah, we both we both got to just sleep and and rest. And woke up this morning to like I know Sarah was hurting a little bit, but um, took care of that, and then she was just awake. And we kind of hung out until the baby woke up and I mean we still hung out but we had Mickey Mouse Clubhouse on this morning um, as well and it was just really really relaxing really peaceful um, once we got pain meds uh, straightened back out Sarah was um, relaxed and feeling all right and I just as after yesterday yesterday was pretty rough and uh, last night the previous night was pretty rough so it just felt like it's such a roller coaster because it's like really hard and then all of a sudden you have this like beautiful light and moment and you're like oh well maybe everything's gonna change and you get this like weird like not not weird but this like unrealistic sense of hope and um and so that's kind of crushing at times but it also feels really good and it kind of gives you a boost of energy that you need for the day and then you know mixed with the caffeine that's gonna obviously be coming too soon um yeah so today started out right and i'm i'm really really happy for that yesterday had some other emotional stuff too going on um and it was i was thinking about best friends and sarah's my best friend like one of my only friends, to be honest, like the person I see every day, a person I confide in, everything, like sh she's that person. Um, she's the one that I check in. Ah, drop my phone. Check in about everything. Always have. Um, essentially since we've met. So, so it's like thinking about best friends and, and when you're going through this process and how it feels and uh, obviously I'm thinking about a lot of other people that are, you know, on this journey with Sarah. And uh, yesterday it just really hit me. Uh, my parents are Sarah's best friends, other than me, of course. And what they are going through is maybe just as difficult as how I'm feeling as well. And it's been really hard on them. We would <laughs> go out and do so much with them. Like we went, we did snowboarding multiple seasons every weekend. We were there. Even when Braden was just a little person, like we were up there with all of us snowboarding and having just, just a blast. And, and uh like my mom fell once and Sarah was the only one to stay behind my mom reminds us all the freaking time it's hilarious and uh <clears throat> I remember like snowboarding down to the lift and then getting down to where you got to unbuckle one of your feet and my my dad and and Sarah down there just dancing away wiggling their butts god so good such good times and uh I just love that they are here supporting me in every way, doing everything they can when they're able to, to make Sarah just smile, just little, just little moments. And My dad has been the number one person, <clears throat> excuse me, helping me with Rayla 
end. Man, to see them play. So much I like the relationship that he has with Sarah and I'm so lucky and so happy that that's gonna be able to stay that I'm gonna be able to see that joy both in him and our little mini Sarah little stubborn girl for reals so I just wanted to share that because uh, my parents have been absolutely amazing <laughs> through all of our struggles through all of this they have been there for us every moment of the way in in every way possible if we said we needed something BAM they were there ready to help. And I'm not saying they're the only ones, obviously, but we just have a really, really, really special relationship with them. And, and uh, because they are Sarah's best friends and favorite kid, because I know that's not me, my brother. It might be my sister sometimes, but I'm pretty sure that daughter-in-law is their favorite kid. Which is fine. She's my favorite person too. So anyway, just really wanted to share that and uh, just kind of publicly, I guess, share how amazing they've been throughout everything in my life and and everything in, in our lives since I've met Sarah. So yeah. Have a wonderful day, morning, night, wherever you are. And remember to be kind and make good choices. Bye.